Well, how does it feel to be back in Pensacola in, in a different role as, a, as an assistant, a graduate assistant now? Yeah, it feels great. Um, I've missed it here, honestly. Um, it's just such a good place to be, and I love my time when I was here playing. And, uh, you know, it's, I just picked right up where I left off. You know, it's just got, it got welcomed here with open arms, and um, I'm just so thankful to be here. You know, this is a, a different staff, obviously, without Coach Shinnick here anymore, but you know some of the guys played with some of the guys on this team. What, what are your impressions of the new regime? Oh, I love them. I love them. I, I love the energy that they bring, the knowledge that they bring. I mean, the defensive coaches are unreal. Uh, you know, Coach Connor, Coach Mello, and all those guys on that side of the ball are just great. Uh, they bring the juice and the energy, and I love their scheme. And then the offense-wise, you know, I know Coach Nobles really well, and I, I mean, I played with Coach Wintrick, uh, Coach D. I, I've known, so uh, obviously Coach Sonia, you know. So I know these guys really well, and, um, you know, I just feel like I fit in really good with them, and I love what they do, so it's cool. You know, we, we, we kind of kept an eye on you when you left here. Uh, you, you've gone a couple different places to kind of walk everybody through what the last couple of years have been like for you. Yeah, yeah. So, um, yeah, I went a couple other places uh, past here, uh, finished up college. I got a master's degree from the University of Idaho, and then I played up in the CFL for about two years. Um, and this past year, I thought I was going to be playing. Things didn't work out that way. And um, I was really fortunate that uh, I got released, and, and Coach Nobles was right there to pick me up and offer me an opportunity. And, um, you know, I, I couldn't say yes quick enough. So it was awesome. You still wanting to play? Is that still part of the plan, or? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. It's it's hard to hang up the cleats. Obviously, I don't know. I don't know if anybody ever knows truly when they want to hang up the cleats. But um, I'm just gonna gonna take it day by day, and and I'm I'm loving my time here right now. So I'm just gonna focus on this season. Hey, so you're working with you know tight ends and running backs a little bit uh, as a quarterback. That's kind of cool because you you can understand what they're doing. Yeah, it is cool. It is cool. Um, I kind of have a different perspective. You know, I can kind of talk through reads with them and help them understand conceptually what's going on from a quarterback point of view, so maybe help grow their knowledge of the game. And I'm um, actually this last year in the CFL, I was playing tight end, so I got a little bit of experience on that side and during special teams and stuff like that. So I think I got a good, like, well-rounded experience to be able to share with these guys and hopefully make them better. Good to have you back, man. Yes, sir. Thank you.